Hey guys, Sarah Fuller here with Easy Adapted PE. Today I am just going to do a little compilation of a few fun, quick, and easy activities that I have been doing with my kiddos. So some are with kiddos and walkers, other are just um, some of my self-contained classes. So those kiddos with maybe autism or those any kind of uh, learning disability or intellectual disabilities are just some fun things that I've been doing lately because it's been hard for us to get outside. I hope you enjoyed these activities and please like, subscribe, ring the bell, all the things, and I will keep making more videos. Also, please feel free to leave a comment and ask for videos. I just ran to a professor of mine, Dr. Lauren Lieberman, and she was chatting with me about her new book that she's coming out with, and I was able to do a couple videos for her about some of those different pieces that are in her book. You can get your hands on it. I would super recommend it, and I hope you enjoy this video. First up is the bag of balloons activity. You want to make sure that you have clear plastic garbage bags and a bunch of balloons already blown up inside the bags have an aide grab the bag you have all the kids in the circle aides around the outside and just start hitting that bag up in the air the kids love it the aides love it you can add two bags three bags however you feel and it's a really great activity for hand-eye coordination and tracking skills Next up is the wall race warm up. This one you're gonna make sure that you have a take out bucket with a picture of a car and a put in bucket. Kids grab a car from the take out bucket, they go across the roads that are already up on the walls and then when they get to the put in bucket, they put the cars back in. This is really great for following directions. Okay guys, so literally what I do is I will laminate a piece of black paper and I think I use some sort of like a silver sharpie and then on the back is Velcro and you just stick these literally on the wall and then the kids will drive their cars around. So maybe they drive it once around, then they put it in the bucket, they get a new car, they drive around again. It's great as kind of just a little addition to your warm up because Sometimes just coming in and doing laps is like so boring, I'm gonna like explode. So adding some new things in there will really get exciting. And this is typically for my non-integrated classes. I wouldn't necessarily do this in integrated unless I'd talk to the phys ed teachers first and they were also on board. Okay, so the bag of balloons is literally get like six to 10 balloons, put them in a plastic garbage bag and I don't have mine here with me, but you can use the clear plastic garbage bags because then they can see all the different colors. But if you just have a black one, that's fine. That could actually be cool if you made a little face on it for like Halloween, a little fun activity like that. But either way, you start by just tossing it up and it floats. It just beautifully floats in the air. No one's gonna get hurt by it. Everybody's laughing and giggling. The aids love it because it's super fun. It's easy to do and it's very easy to do hand over hand with somebody who might need it. If you have somebody who's a little bit more fragile, maybe they're in a wheelchair or a walker, it's not gonna hurt if they get bonked in the face. It's not going to, you know, cause any injury. And by putting the balloons in the bag, then the kids aren't touching latex either. As long as the bag isn't made of latex, you might want to check that. So these are just two of uh, very simple but new and fun activities. Hopefully you like them. Again, I know my videos are a little bit different than they used to be, but uh, I am doing my best and I hope that you guys love them. Please leave some comments. I would love to talk about more activities if that's what you guys need. Uh, goals, uh, goals, whatever you guys want to talk about, I'm here for it. All right, talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.